I want to use this simple example of finding the mean of these seven numbers to illustrate how to use the Casio FX260 solar calculator, which is the one I'll be using in class to calculate means. The first thing that you want to do is to make sure that you don't have any anything already in the calculator memory or in the uh, statistical data. So when you first start, it's probably a good idea to press the on. That kind of clears things out. Then to go in the statistics mode, you press the mode key and then down near the bottom left there's a decimal key and you press that. Mode followed by the decimal key. And if you can see up in the upper corner now, upper right corner, there's an SD. That may be hard for you to see, but look for an SD and that tells you that you're in stats mode. Okay, now that we know that we're in stats mode, we want to enter these numbers. So what you do is you take each one of them one at a time. So I'll do 11.7, 11.7, and then you click the M plus, the memory add key, and that puts that data point into your data set. And the next one is 13.7, so you 13.7, memory plus again. And the next one, even though I'm sort of covering it up, is 24.7, 24.7. And so you do memory plus again. And the next one, which I definitely have covered up, is 9.7. But the important point is what I'm doing here, 9.7, memory plus. And the next one is 24.7, so you get 24.7, memory plus, then 14.7, memory plus and finally 10.7 and click or press memory plus. Now that puts the numbers in the data set within the calculator. Once you get the data set in the calculator in order to calculate the mean press the shift key followed by the uh, number 7, which is um, the shift key is X bar, which is the symbol for the mean. And the answer in the display is the mean, 15.7. So when all is said and done, we now know that X bar is 15.7, and that is the mean.